So it was an amazing experience, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm a Celtic boy through and through, so just to be on that pitch with them legends and, you know, it was just that lap of honour at the end, something will stay with me for the rest of my life. So, you know. Well, I thought, I seen Lou Bogan doing, so I thought it was a certainty he was taking it, and I turned around and I thought, I seen James with it, I thought James just picked it up, and I thought, that's a bold move. Um, but he put it away, didn't he? He put it right in the top corner, so I'm, I'm delighted for him. He's chuffed to bits. Can you just clear up one thing? How many games did you play for more? Two or something, and we get beat both of them. I mean, I was, I think that's, I think it's a wee bit overblown, especially when you're at there and people say you're an ex pro. I was like, I'll put a couple of games for reserves, but I mean, I chucked it when I was 17, so I was kind of happy to make my debut and then the end, and then they asked me to stay on another year, but the Sweet 16 took off, so I mean, but it's getting further and further away. It's over a decade now. <laughs> and, uh, you, had, you had the choice, didn't you? Aye, at the time, but again, people make a big but it wasn't a. It wasn't between Real Madrid and Spider Man. It was, <laughs> it was another year at Morton. I'm unemployed, <laughs> and I took you unemployed. Mm. Well, you had it last night, was that a we had a few. I, I could feel that. But then you kind of, I think doing that, you kind of, I think we're all, it was well, we're all a bit nervous, you know what I mean? But it was uh, last night. It was, uh, it was a fantastic night. Uh, it was great just to see uh, OM legends again. Everybody turn out, and obviously people were paying to be there and stuff. And the auction went great, and some of the lads who'd paid were in the dressing room ways, and you know, I mean, all felt like party team. So. It was great. I mean, it's just an amazing weekend. You know, McStay's, I was saying last night, McStay's the sort of the epitome of the club, him and Tommy Burns. You know, the way they carry themselves as human beings and the charity element and the abundance of football talent they have. You know, they're everything what Celtic's about. Did you get any chance to speak to Ollie Tomlinson? So I think you were playing the last time. I got panelled, didn't he? <laughs> now, if we're playing, we're coming back. No, I haven't seen him. We'll, we have, uh, I think we'll probably see them when we mix after the game, but we're keeping in a cell again. Uh, so we'll try to keep it. We'll try to keep it a wee bit feisty, you know what I mean. But it was a good day. There, there's some. I know some of the other boys, my pals as well. So it was a right good day. Fitness wise, how are you feeling? Nah, I admit my ribs. I've not. That's the first time I've actually jogged and thingy because of because my ribs. So I was feeling it, but I think I'll feel it in the morning. But I think the adrenaline just gubbed a couple of painkillers and just run through it. You know what I mean.